My name is Paul Gazdick. I work for the City of Bellingham's Office of Emergency Management. I'm currently standing in the Whatcom Unified Emergency Coordination Center. This facility houses both the city and county's emergency management program. We come together in a Whatcom Unified partnership in order to respond to and mitigate from major or small scale disasters. At our emergency coordination center between June 7th and 8th, we had over 350 people inside this facility itself. We had ranging from volunteers to City of Bellingham staff to county, state, and federal partners to test out how we would realistically respond to a 9.0 earthquake with a tsunami to follow. One of the main things that we tested out here was their check-in process, staffing, and how information flows through each one of our sections. With a large-scale drill like this, we have to perform what's called unified command. That's where we bring in different incident commanders to make unified decisions within our emergency coordination center. This may consist of police, fire, EMS, policymakers, mayors, county executives. During the 32 hours of the exercise, we had many press releases that were sent out. We also had a real press briefing talking about some of the ups and downs. We put forward an activity, over a thousand people involved. That's um, fabulous. With a large-scale disaster such as the Cascadia subduction zone earthquake, we do not have the personnel to reach every single emergency that will happen. That is why we've utilized and trained volunteers in order to help supplant some of those resources that will be taxed during an earthquake. We identified 24 different sites for our volunteers to go check. We gave them manila envelopes with a photoshopped pictures of the buildings that they were assigned to. They then took that information, found the spots on the map, and reported back what they saw to our dispatch center. There, our police, fire, and public works did incident prioritization, where they assessed what they were hearing from our community emergency response team volunteers and allocated resources to the most needed places. Inside the church. Roger that. This is the first time we tried this pilot program, and we think it was a success. We're hoping to build off of this and incorporate it into other parts of our neighborhoods and even other parts of towns and villages within Whatcom County. These exercises give us a really good test to make mistakes in a no-fault situation. Over the next couple of months, we will put together a report, which is called an after-action report, which also houses an improvement plan. In this improvement plan, it'll give us a timeline highlighting different departments, different agencies that our offices will reach out to and do smaller level exercises, drills, or full-scale exercises in the future. If you want to learn more about what we do at the Emergency Coordination Center or how you and your family can prepare, visit walkamready.org.